everyone and welcome back to Bookcraft, the world where I build things from my favorite books and my own imagination. Let's get back into the story. So, today is actually a very exciting day in Bookcraft. We are going to be heading over to the island of Krakatoa to look at the diamond mine location, dog ear. We're going to go scout some locations for the diamond mine. Uh, actually, first things first, I wanted to change your collar color in today's episode. Um, I wanted to see if I could make, uh, oh, bone meal, and where's my lapis? If I combine, uh, lapis and bone meal, do I get light blue? Yep, light blue dye. Um, and then I also need to grab all of my diamonds. This is the big day. I have 16 diamonds. This is what we have been holding them for. I'll leave that one there. Uh, we're bringing my diamonds to uh, where we pick for our diamond mine. So let's go ahead and uh, let's change your collar color. I think I'm going to like the light blue. <gasps> oh, that looks so good on you, dog ear. I love it. Uh, I really, really like it. <laughs> Little paint cans. Uh, okay, before I forget, let's get to uh, the word of the episode. So the word of today's episode is going to be a word actually that exists within Minecraft that you might not have ever thought about before, which is glister. And glister means to sparkle, to shimmer, uh, kind of, I guess, close to glisten. They all sort of sound the same, glitter, glisten, glister. Uh, but glister is a thing in Minecraft. If you think about glistering melons, they're sparkly melons. So glister means to sparkle, and so do diamonds. Diamonds also sparkle. So that is our word of the episode. Put that back in there, and I've got the 21 balloons. Uh, should I turn off my computer? <laughs> I can't really turn off my computer. But, uh, Dog Ear, I'm very sorry to say that I don't think you're going to be coming with me today on my adventure. I still haven't quite worked out a safe way to transport you. I need... Hmm, maybe I need to, to test you going in the minecart sometime and see. I haven't had much luck with that in my other Minecraft series, Dog Ear, and I don't want you to die. Uh, but maybe in 1.8.1, you can ride in a minecart. We will uh, we'll explore that on a different day, Dog Ear, but here, uh, for today, you can just stay and read. Uh, don't look at me that way. I'm sorry. We're doing dangerous stuff today. We're going mining. Just, just stay. She looks so much like my dog Paige uh, because of the blue collar now, uh, and she's tan. Uh, anyway, all right, let's go uh, to the library, to our 21 balloons uh, tunnel. Uh, let's grab a mine cart, and uh, we are off. And actually, I wanted to read part of the book uh, in today's episode. This is page 65 in my copy. Uh, a New Citizen of Krakatoa is the chapter. It's chapter 5. Um, oh, I just remembered I'm going to have to transfer lines right here. Uh, oop, can I, uh, can I get out? Oh. Did it again. Did the same thing again, and I have no blocks. Uh, <laughs> we need to, I need to uh, find a solution for that. Uh, because it's impossible to get out of the cart without uh, falling down. Uh, pillar back up. And then grab my cart. And then we'll come over here and put it back down. Uh, okay. So, uh, as I was saying, I'm reading the part where Professor Sherman lands on the island of Krakatoa. And this is actually what I was talking about. Oh, I haven't hit any. I have to progress the minecart until I hit a powered rail. There we go. I have hit a powered rail. Uh, okay, so when he gets to the island, uh, oops, my inventory. Oops, what am I doing wrong here? I'm trying to go on to, can you not do F1 mode? And there we go. Um, Suddenly, a remarkable change took place in our surroundings. As we neared the mountain, the underbrush in the jungle became less and less bothersome and then ceased to exist altogether. Instead of thick wild roots, giant ferns, banyan trees, and the usual webs of jungle vegetation, I found myself walking on soft green grass, which smelled and looked as though it had just been mowed. So he arrived on this uh, looking like a, a, a jungle island 
only to discover that after you go through the um, all of the lush vegetation, you arrive on grass. So I don't know. Oh, there's an Enderman down there at the wreckage. I don't know if uh, Nathan and the build team have finished the vegetation, uh, but we're going to look. Oh, look at the globe. Um, okay, so we just need to build a glass platform like this uh, over on the other side uh, is what we need to do. There we go. Grab my minecart and put it down here. Uh, anyway, so let's go over to the island. It's not far from the globe, I believe. And I didn't expect it to turn night, though. We need beds. If I had a bed in the globe, I could just duck up there to sleep. Oh, oh, bother. This is not... Oh, I have wool, don't I? Do I still have... Oh, I used it all to pillar up. Oh, maybe there's a sheep on the island that I can... There was a... <gasps> Look at the island! Oh, I'm sad that it's nighttime right now. I can just barely make out all of the jungle trees. It looks like he's still working on some over there. Oh, you can see Mushroom Island over there. Uh, look at this! Look at all the vegetation. Look at the vines coming down! Ah, skeleton! Oh, there is a sheep right there! I can shear him and make a bed if I can just uh, evade the creepers uh, long enough. I can come over here and... Um, He's only going to give me one or two. Come back. No, don't go in there. I need you. Um, all right, grow back. Grow back quickly. And, um, oh, I don't. I can't get up this way. I don't have any wood. I don't want to cut down one of the trees. Oh, this is terrible. We need to sleep and make it day. Um, hmm. Is that a, no, that's a skeleton, I think. Does he see me? Please don't see me. All right, we've got to go back. Uh, we've got to go and find some wood. So I'm going to come this way. Oh, this looks so awesome. Oh, holy skeletons. Uh, quite a few skeletons. Was there a little stump over there? I think there's a stump of where I think maybe he's going to... Um, oops. Oh, oh. Die. Die. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, he's... Yeah, that was my mistake. Oh, man. I just built up their creation. I did get some wood, though. Um, oh, I feel so bad. And I hear a baby zombie. All right, let's get back into... Um, let's get back into the station, maybe. Oh, this brush is so thick. Oh, we missed it. Where's the baby zombie? Um, all right, let me come back up here. I'm not even going to be able to see a baby zombie with this brush. Oh! Uh, <gasps> I didn't get moosh. I was supposed to. I was meant to get mushroom stew as well. I was meant to get mushroom stew as well. Oh, I am just the worst at survival mode in this game. Oh, gosh. Um, all right. We've got planks to make a bed. Uh, we just need the sheep. No, go eat the grass. Go eat the grass. Oh, there's a zombie there. We're going to have to kill the zombie. Oh, I'm hitting the brush. I'm ruining this. <gasps> Did we freeze? Did we freeze? What are they doing? Don't make me ruin our map. There, die. Will you hurry? Just hurry. Come on. Come on. What am I going to do for food, guys? I don't even know. Oh, we're at the end of the line. Come on. Don't... Come back. Where are you going? Eat something. Where are you going? Oh, brother. Hmm. Oh, the flesh. The zombie flesh. Yes. Um. Alright, let's eat. Let's eat some of this. It's uh, not ideal, but it works in a pinch. In fact, we should try to go find some more zombies. Have you... Oh, you're the worst sheep ever. Uh, I can't even see because of because the vegetation is, as it should be, quite thick. But I wonder if it does clear up in the middle like it's supposed to in the book, baby zombie. Why? Uh, do baby zombies even drop flesh? I don't see any. You are just taunting me at this point. Come on. Oh, there's a zombie in there. We need the flesh. We have full hearts. 
So let's risk it. Take out the skeleton first. Then take out the zombie. Get the brains. Oh, got another zombie. Trying not to get too much of this grass. We're going to need to replant this. Got the brains. And any more zombies? No? This sheep. Are you kidding me? How, sheep? Oh, I'm trapped. How have you not regrown? Is it because you need a patch of grass to eat? Is that what is that what's happening here? There we go. Oh, did he drop brains? I don't even know. I only got two. I feel like the sheep possibly needs a patch of grass, which is unfortunate because the jungle is quite dense. Um, hmm. We are one wool short of being able to have a bed and sleep. The sun's just going to come up at this point. Um, we need to sleep, though. I can't have any more creepers explode. The creepers are so similar to tall grass. Will you please just just eat something? Can I, if I shear, can I shear the grass? Yes. Okay, I got it. So I can rebuild that. Uh, if you will just eat some and grow your wool, please. Why do I get myself in situations like, ah, ah, um, oh gosh, do I have, I think I have three arrows on me. Should be enough to kill this guy. Eat the grass, sheep. Oh, oh there's another, let's charge it all the way. There we go. That was, oh wait. Do we have infinity on this bow or something? No, that was our last arrow. Uh, okay. Um, sheep? 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 Sheep, where'd you go? I hear you. Oh, is that you up there? Do you have... You're still naked. Unbelievable. At this point, I'm just going to put the grass back. Uh, at this point, we're just going to... Oh, wait. How do I... How do you get it to grow tall? Oh, bother. I've messed up. No! Ah! Uh, I've messed up this map. Oh, this is sad. And now we have another creeper and a spider. Is there any more sheep on this island besides the one that we already sheared? Sun's going down at this point. How ridiculous. Um, I just see creepers. We could go to that side of the map because that's kind of the undeveloped side. Yep, look at this. Sun's coming up. What a failure. Um, all right, let's... Uh, oops, I'm not throwing it out right. There we go. Um, let's come down here. Kill this zombie because we're going to need the brains. Thank you. What was that? Did he drop something else? I'm not sure. Um, and then let's come over here and kill you two for your brains. Oh, nothing. Uh, oh, creeper, no. Oh, look at all the zombies over there now. Look at this. I hope we don't die. Oh, this is beautiful in, in the daylight. All right, come on, guys. Zombie villager doesn't have a texture. That's okay. Okay, get all the brains, get all the brains. Are we getting all the brains? Die! Give me all your brains. I will take all of these. And you're dead. But did we get your brains? We've got eight. Which is pretty good. I'm sinking all the way to the bottom. We better swim up now. We better swim up. I don't think I... I think I lost some of the brains. That's okay, though. Oops. There we go. All right. It is now daytime. So we can actually just forget the bed and run into the center of the island and hope that there's no... <gasps> ah! Uh, please die. Oh, you dropped an arrow, I think. Um, oh, that's probably how I got more than three arrows in the first place. I'm getting all of the grass. Move over here. I'm not going to continue to break the hard work. Ooh, is this the outline for the house? This may be the outline for the Moroccan House of Marbles. Uh, ooh, that would be cool. 
Ooh, I like it. I like it quite a bit. Um, all right. So I think right now we just need to find, well, one, I want to make sure that there's no creepers out here. But two, we need to find a place kind of, I guess, maybe on this side of the island that we can dig down for a diamond mine. Now, Nathan did mention that they had, oh, oh, maybe this is it. He mentioned that there was a mine, like a, um, a cave on the, I can't see anything uh, that there was a cave already on the island. That must be it. So, oh wait, there's something there too. What is over there? No, that doesn't go down. All right, so can we get back to where we just, oh, nope. Let's get back to that cave because there was no grass there. So that has to be, I'm lost again. I am complete, ah! Here it is, uh, torches, torches, torches. This, ooh, 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 is that a sheep or a creeper? This might be a perfect diamond mine um, to fill with diamonds. So let's go down and check it out. Oh, well, there's light down there. There could be lava. Let's build a staircase. Is that, no, that's not. Um, there we go. And then, oops, nope, we need another one down like that so we can get back up. Um, ah! Nope, we just fell. Just put a torch down there. What the heck? What is this? <gasps> There's a diamond mine already here. They must have finished. Um, all right, quickly, let's eat the flesh. Oh, why did I do that? I don't want particles on me. How long do these particles last? 24, 23, 22. <gasps> okay, hold on. Let's read from the book. Um, wait a minute. So there's the door. I'm looking at a picture of the door in the book. And it looks really similar. There appeared to be an entrance in this wall covered up by an old door. Wait, that looks like a, that looks like an iron door though. Oh, he puts on glasses because it's going to be so bright. I wonder if they just did the door or if they actually finished the mine. This is just like in the book. All right, let's go. Are you ready? One, two, three. <gasps> Look at all the diamond blocks. Wait a minute, are those diamonds just like falling out of the water? Look at that! Look at that, they're just falling out. I've already got 19. Oh my gosh. Look at, that's all diamond ore. Those are diamond blocks. That's glass. <gasps> Look in the little, like the little mine cart. This is awesome. Oh my gosh. How far does it go up? <gasps> this looks so cool. <laughs> Can you imagine if you were actually in Minecraft and you came across, <gasps> that's so cool. You came across this while caving. <gasps> look at all the diamond blocks up there. Look at all the diamond ore. And look at the mine cart going through. That is so cool. This is, oh my gosh, this is awesome. When did they do this? Look at all the diamonds. Look at that. Look at all the diamonds coming out of the water. That is so cool from a dispenser. I have, I'm literally, it's just like the book because look, I've already picked up 50. It's just like the book when he, uh, it says he was dumbfounded. Uh, the walls, the floor, the ceiling of this mine were hewn out of the hardest of all nature's minerals. Pure, clear, dazzling diamonds. I was up to my ankles in diamond pebbles. The floor was covered with diamond boulders and diamonds as big as cobblestones. Wow. They recreated the diamond mine of Krakatoa from the book. And I cannot even believe this. Was this... This must have been like time to when I opened the door or something for all these diamonds to shoot out. I almost don't want to leave because they'll just despawn, but I mean, I guess I could always mine more. Ah, can you go, I kind of want to see, like, can you go up any? Like, where's the minecart going? Oh, this is so epic. Oh my gosh. Wow. I, I, I already have over a stack of diamonds. This is fantastic. Uh, okay, so I guess we don't need to, uh... I, I guess we can cross diamond mine off of the list. Wow.
Have you ever seen something so cool in Minecraft? I, I wish I could discover stuff like this just, you know, as I was caving. In a UHC, perhaps. Wow. All right. Well, I, I think there, there's no better place to end this episode but here in the diamond mine. This is awesome. Uh, good job, Nathan, and the, the wall shared build team. This is so epic. Um, oh, I love it. I'm collecting so many diamonds. All right. Uh, until next time, Paige and Molly love you. Go read a book. <laughs>